Ocean is an ocean data company, but the way you collect data differs from traditional methods. Can you tell me a bit about that? Yeah, so XOcean is an ocean data company and we use a marine robotic system known as an unmanned surface vessel to collect this data. The sort of data we're collecting are things like mapping the seabed, looking at subsea pipelines, looking at, say, cables uh, and, and connections. Um, the, the way an unmanned system works is that we have a control room on shore, we then have a satellite connection to the vessel, and the vessel is on its own. It's operating anywhere from a few kilometres to a few hundred kilometres offshore, and, and that is fully controlled by the team of people that are onshore. Advantages of collecting data this way, first of all, safety. So there's no humans offshore, so that removes a massive risk from, uh, from the marine operation. The second thing is environment. So we can operate for three weeks continuously, 24 hours a day, but we only use around nine liters of diesel per 24 hours. It, it, an example of that is a, is a survey ship could use nine tons of diesel, a thousand times more fuel. Um, and we also use a solar array, which gives us about 20% range extension through just using natural sunlight. And thirdly, and importantly, is we can deliver the data at a lower cost. Wow, that's uh, some pretty compelling benefits there. <laughs> and so can you give me an example of some of the projects you've worked on? Yeah, we've completed a number of projects across a number of different sectors. Uh, one of the things we've been focused on the last six months has been the UK's civil hydrography programme, and this is updating chart data. We've completed surveys around Scotland, around the northeast of England, uh, around the east coast of England, and that's, as say, collecting bathymetric survey data. We've also completed a number of projects in the oil and gas sector, predominantly looking at pipelines and looking at the integrity of those subsea structures, and we've done that for multiple oil and gas companies. That's really interesting. And looking ahead to 2030, what, what changes do you envisage for the ocean data sector? Yeah, I, I think everybody's indicating a massive growth in the ocean economy. People such as the OECD would be predicting a doubling of the ocean economy to three trillion in the next decade. Uh, and we believe the foundation for that growth, be it aquaculture, offshore wind, oil and gas, leisure uses, it all needs to be underpinned by data. Data really is the foundation here. So we see that there's going to be a need for more data and more often to collect that data. And we believe unmanned systems can present a really, really useful way of collecting that. Thank you very much.